physiques of some upcoming Mr. Olympic competitors. I'm trying to rank and compare them. Yeah, buddy. As the 2022 Mr. Olympia edges closer, several high-profile athletes and media are starting to predict who will be successful at Mr. Olympia. Ronnie Coleman, one of the best bodybuilders in the history of the sport, gives his prediction of who will place in the top 10. Being an eight times Mr. Olympia winner, rest assured, Ronnie Coleman knows what he's talking about when it comes to predicting the top 10 at Mr. Olympia. Nick Walker. Starting with Nick Walker, Ronnie is impressed with the 2021 New York Pro and Arnold Classic winner. Nick the Mutant Walker has had his eyes on the prize for a while now. As an International Federation of Bodybuilding and Fitness rookie, Walker won the 2021 Arnold Classic and captured a fifth place result in 2021 Mr. Olympia. Now, the 28-year-old bodybuilder is hungry to accomplish so much more. Ronnie believes that Nick will need to do some work on his chest, but other than that, he is complete. Walker once discussed his future and goals as a bodybuilder. In the process, Walker maintained that he plans to rise to the top of the sport as an all-time great. As for his personal future, Walker is aiming high. Few bodybuilders have enjoyed such stellar debut seasons as Walker. After foregoing a defense of his title at the 2022 Arnold Classic to focus exclusively on December's Olympia, it seems Walker is treating that initial flourish like a first step. Nick will want to improve on his fifth-place finish at the 2021 Mr. Olympia with the goal of defeating defending champion Big Ramey. Probably needs to improve on and rank his physique according to other guys. Hunter Labrada. Next is Hunter Labrada, an IFBB professional bodybuilder and businessman from the U.S. His father is bodybuilding legend Lee Labrada. His journey has been much different than that of most pro bodybuilders, growing up with two parents who also competed. His father is the legendary Lee Labrada, who is one of the greatest open division bodybuilders of all time. Lee won Mr. Universe in 1985, placed top four seven consecutive times at the Olympia, and in 2004 was inducted into the IFBB Pro Bodybuilding Hall of Fame. His mother, Robin Labrada, also competed and has been by Hunter's side during his bodybuilding journey. She also has a pretty good eye for bodybuilding, and Hunter has said her opinion is as valuable as his father's. Just like Nick Walker, Ronnie is happy with his V-taper and, as well, thinks his back needs a bit more width. Regarding his arms, Coleman suggests that Hunter improves his peak on his biceps. Hunter finished in fourth place in 2021, just ahead of Nick Walker. He got a pretty decent uh, V-taper here. Uh, he'll, he'll be pretty good. Probably need just to be a little bit wider. Blessing Awudibu. The 2022 New York Pro winner, Blessing Awudibu, will be making his Mr. Olympia debut in December 2022. He is an Irish professional bodybuilder known for his huge and aesthetic physique. A force of nature, as he's called by some people, Blessing is a highly successful bodybuilder, boasting two Arnold Classic titles, along with four IFBB overall champion titles. The first thing that Ronnie noticed was Blessing's abdominals. He is very impressed with their development. In regards to his arms, Ronnie believes that Blessing needs a bit more roundness. The positives are that Blessing has a great vacuum when he poses. Blessing has great leg development, but Ronnie sees beyond that and suggests he gets some more separation. Blessing's traps need more work, and Ronnie was not that impressed. Great abs for the most part. Got a great vacuum. Michael Crizo. Michael Crizo Kurzanak is an IFBB elite pro bodybuilder from Slovakia. He is one of the biggest mass monsters in the world and is famous for his massive arm size. Michael Crizo is one of the best pro competitors competing outside the IFBB Pro League of all time. Michael has just won his pro card in Italy after making the switch from the IFBB Elite Pro where he had a very successful run of victories. The first body part that Ronnie was impressed with was his arms. Michael most possibly has the best arms in the world. Michael's chest development is also very good. Ronnie did not take long to point that out. Michael's most criticized body part is his back. When it comes to back development, Ronnie is the king and he knows what he's talking about. Ronnie points out that Crizo needs more back width and thickness. Ronnie notices that Michael's arms are so big, they distract his back pose. Once Michael improves on his back development, Coleman believes he will have an incredible physique. Freaky, freaky, freaky arms right there. Nice, big chest. It's big, some width on it, I say. Hadi Chupan. Next up is the great Hadi Chupan. Hadi has been placing in the top five at Mr. Olympia for a number of years. Hadi is known for its incredible condition. 
Ronnie is impressed with Hottie's V-taper, as well he is impressed with his shoulders and traps development. Basically from the front, Ronnie Coleman is very impressed with what he is seeing at this stage in prep. Well, Ronnie was so impressed that he believes that Hottie can win over Mr. Olympia eventually. Not too many people get the nod from Coleman. Hottie is part of a very exclusive club of athletes. It must also be noted that Hottie has won numerous world and Asian champion titles with the IFBB during his amateur career. He got a real, a real nice V taper there. You know, I like that a lot. Nice shoulders right there. Nice traps and everything going on him. Nice arms on him. Big Ramey. LSBA or Big Ramey made his splash in the IFBB Pro League at the 2013 New York Pro, stepping on stage to around 300 pounds. Bodybuilders at this time were known to be big, but not quite this big. Fans and experts were mind blown by the Egyptian newcomer. Big Ramey has won two consecutive Mr. Olympia titles and is a favorite to defend his title and win number three. Ronnie starts his review by predicting that Big Ramey will most probably be with 2022 Mr. Olympia. Ramey will be the biggest on stage at this year's event. Ronnie could not find any problems with Ramey's physique, confirming he is the favorite to win again. Immediately, Ronnie congratulates him ahead of time to win 2022 Mr. Olympia. Right here, he's got a real nice V on this, on this shot right here, I can see. I don't see nobody taking him out. Nobody at all. William Bonack William Bonack has been a threat to Big Ramey for a number of years. Training in silence and staying away from the media, William is expected to shock a number of bodybuilders in 2022. A favorite of Ronnie Coleman, there is not too much to criticize about William's physique. The only suggestion that Ronnie had was Williams needs to get his back a little bit wider and thicker. Just like Hattie Chupan, Ronnie believes that Bonac can win Mr. Olympia in the future. The modern-day giant killer is predicted to be a top three finisher again this year. Great V taper, got great shoulders on him, nice chest on him, nice arms on him, nice side shot right here. Andrew Jacked Andrew Jacked is one of the most talked about bodybuilders in 2022. Making the switch to the NPC after competing with the IFBB Elite Pro, Andrew immediately impressed by winning the 2022 Arnold UK and the Texas Pro. Many believe the rising prospect Andrew Jacked, real name, Janedu Andrew Obikia, is expected to bring one of the best packages at this year's Olympia. After winning the 2022 Texas Pro, Jacked gained recognition in the community. He received a lot of praise from bodybuilding legends, such as Jay Cutler and Mark Anthony who believe Andrew has the potential to take over the men's open division. Andrew will be making his Mr. Olympia debut this December. Being new to the game, Andrew will be hoping to place in the top 10. Ronnie was immediately impressed with his physique, but pointed out that Andrew needs to also improve his back. Ronnie believes that Andrew can dominate any open show and is the future of bodybuilding. Got nice arms on him. Uh, the only thing I can really, he got a nice back shot there. You get that bad boy separated, just a little bit thicker. Brandon Curry and Sean Clarita. To round off his top 10 predictions, Ronnie left out Brandon Curry and Sean Clarita due to not having updated photos available, but he does mention them in his final top 10 finishers. 2019 Mr. Olympia champion Brandon Curry is viewed today as one of bodybuilding's most elite athletes. Standing at under 5 feet 7 inches, Curry always recognized that attempting to dwarf his mass monster opponents is out of the question. Curry's rise to the top has faced both physical and mental challenges. His accomplishments are what one might expect from an all-time great bodybuilder. He won the 2019 Mr. Olympia and the 2019 and 2022 Arnold Classics and finished as the runner-up at the Mr. Olympia contests in 2020 and 2021, both won by reigning champion Madhu Big Ramey Elsbier. And the other candidate for the top 10 mentioned by Coleman, Sean Clarita, is an American bodybuilder hailing from New Jersey. Standing at just 5'2", he was able to achieve remarkable success on the bodybuilding stage, earning IFBB professional status in 2012. As a result, he acquired the nickname The Giant Killer, a reminder of his ability to emerge victorious ahead of athletes that towered over him. Starting his fitness journey throughout high school, he took part in competitive sports ranging from wrestling to basketball fulfilling his desire for an adventurous lifestyle. In the process, he brushed off negative comments from those who doubted his abilities. Soon enough, he became an inspiration across the world, renowned for his strength and determination. That's all for today's video. See you next time.